Hi everyone, it's Paul again. So today I'm going to talk about the joy of owning the noble Sultan Damascus IEM earphone. So what you see in front of you is the limited edition um, Sultan earphone. I purchased this a while ago. I haven't had the chance to do the review on it. Um, I listened to this with the Luxury and Precision LP6TI. I did a review on that already. So you can have a check that out and have a look. But um, when I bought it, I didn't know um, much about this version because I, I didn't buy this new because these, these were sold out. So I had to buy it from a guy. And when I met him and I tried it, I didn't even know that this was the number one limited edition one. So I feel really privileged to get this uh, version. Nice plate in metal. So I've got number one of this limited edition. And then, um, but I mean, the main thing is that these are a seven driver um, um, top of the line earphone. What I like about the sound is that it's, it's got um, one driver for, as a 10 millimeter dynamic driver, which gives it the warm, wide sound stage sound like a hi-fi sound it's got four BAs okay um, balanced armature and it's got two high frequency drivers so with these seven drivers it can handle probably the whole spectrum of the sound and that's why I think I like it I listen to these the most almost every night I listen to this um, the cable is very nice I don't think you need to change it at all. I, I, I've got some other cables, but I felt this cable was um, was sufficient. It's got the Pentacon 4.4 connector, which is one of the best on the market. I don't think um, there's any one that are better than this connectors at the moment made in Japan, all right? And then let's see what you get with it. So this is the case here. Get a little pouch to put your earphone in. I don't usually use that because I have I use the van vanu or van Ney, um one from the US um, this is the original receipt I'm not going to show you but roughly it's the price was the original price is about 2700 pounds something like that um, and you get some spin tips or um, sorry the IEMs I'm not sure whether the spin spin fit ones and then you've got this band and further casing to put your IM in. These are the the earphone tips. And it comes in a waterproof case, this waterproof case. And here is the box kept in pristine condition um, sold by ECT the distributor here in Hong Kong but yeah so this is made as you can see the face plate is made from Damascus steel which is a, a traditional process of hammering out these you know 112 layers of steel forged together to give you this um, really tough steel right which they use in these um, olden days um, swords and the actual case itself is is um, CNC aluminium what I like about this is that um, the fitting fits my ear really well very comfortable fits it completely inside and the, mat and the fact that they managed to get the seven drives into something that small as this, which fits in these great, you know, once you start looking at dynamic drivers, like 10 millimeter ones, they usually get really big, right, in the casing. And, and usually when you pop it in your ear, some of it sticks out. So it could be heavy and uncomfortable. But I found these to be a pleasure to wear. And I could wear it for over three hours. Anything I could wear over three hours, I consider to be very good. And, um, and very comfortable. There are some very expensive earphones that 
are not maybe not as comfortable in in the way they fit your ear. Not not that I'm saying there's anything wrong with them. I mean, because everybody's ears are different. But my one's considered to be large anyway. It's my ear, so um, I could take a lot in there. But you have to get something that's comfortable at the end of the day. Hence the reason why they come up with some CM custom made um, casing, right? So that you could wear it in comfort when you listen to long hours. And um, you know, especially if you're traveling, right? A lot of people carry these with them to travel. So the sound is brilliant. I think it, the reason why I like this is because I'm a hi-fi guy. I'm a vinyl, you know, um, tube type of guy. I like the warm sound, but I also like the the high fidelity, the high treble, detailed sound as well. And I think this these earphones completes the bill in that it's detailed as well because they have those two high frequency drivers, right? And it's got the dynamic driver. So it's quite a rare combination to get. Because usually nowadays the top of the line ones all come out with maybe like, you know, the, the Viking one, which I own as well from Noble. They, they, they don't um, have the dynamic driver. They're all like BAs, or, or, you know, 13 of them. So you get very specific type of sound but these ones are I like so check these out they're quite old now they came out for some time but these are the ones that I wear every day you can see that the cable is fraying um, but these are my go-to IEMs and anything I use every day that I could use every day I consider to be good okay and I've got number one. Anyway, hope I've given you some view on these IEM so you can check it out. Like and subscribe. Thanks. Bye.